Hello everyone, it is Artifacts96 back for another video for you guys. Thank you to everyone who has liked, commented, and subscribed thus far. And if you want to join the tribe, if you do want to, ain't nobody going to make you sweet, but we would love to have you though. <laughs> if you would like to join the tribe, only thing you have to do is hit that subscription button and hit that notification bell. Y'all, I actually said it right for the first time. Oh my God, my ex-husband would be so proud of me. Anyway, so yes, you've read the title, so let's get into it. David Hogg is apparently starting a new company. What type of company? I hear you ask. A pillow company. And yes, I know you're thinking, huh? How weird that he saw the pillow company, right? Yes. But no, actually, not really. It's not weird. But he's doing it to take the absolute piss out of Mike Mendel. He even said that he is doing this with the intended purpose to put CEO Mike Mendel out of business with his my pillow crap and let me just tell you something i really hope uh i really wish david hall all the best i sent him all my positive vibes and if you have if you've never heard of david hall before david hall survived a very very terrible ordeal in 2018 i believe it was uh the parkland shooting if not i'll correct myself in editing i believe it was the parkland shooting and yeah, um, he, a lot of his classmates did not make it, but he and some more of his classmates did. And there was a very traumatic ordeal for him. And not he not only had to deal with that of that terrible, terrible day, but he also had to deal with the stupid ass bullshit that is right leaning people and their clinginess to their guns. It's really something how I saw how everybody once saw them act because usually the first thing they always say is protect the children, protect the children. But in 2018, I guess uh, the flavor of the day was protect the children, but if it has something to do with my guns and me uh, being able to have a gun just like that, instead of waiting like two months, then fuck them children. I guess that's what they were saying because that's the vibe that they cast to him. They shaded him, they insulted him, and it was just completely unnecessary. So with David Hogg, I send you all my positive energy, and I hope his company does well. And as far as is my pillow guy goes i'm glad that this company's doing terrible because he has been showing his goddamn ass for the past four years now and even before that but we're not going to get into it uh in this video because i don't feel like it ha! but yes since these past four years he has been really showing his ass because of the whole trump thing and even while trump is no longer president mike mandel is still touting conspiracy theories saying that trump is still president yada 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 but also the reason why Mike Mandel's company is going on is not just because of people are getting sick of him, everyday people like you and me, but also companies are starting to get sick of him as well. There have been a lot of stores and also internet brands that have stopped carrying his comp uh, stopped carrying his product, <clears throat> my pillow, because he is an absolute PR nightmare for them, especially when it comes down to um, touting out conspiracy theories, especially when we have seen the absolute horror their conspiracy theories will cause during the Capitol riots. We don't want to see any more of that happening. So they stopped holding his brand. I'm glad his brand is going down the drain. I'm going to say that right here. I I'm glad that he is. For one thing, the goddamn pillows ain't worth shit. Second of all, he donated to get Kyle Rittenhouse out of fucking jail. And that, 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 that shit never sat right with me for obvious reasons. Because this is someone who... Claims to be just oh so such a good Christian man, but you can sit there and use your money, use your wealth, use your so-called blessings now, because that's what he calls his wealth. A lot of people like him calls his uh, wealth blessings. You use your blessing like that to get out this asshole that actually killed somebody. I'm glad your shit is going down the drain. I'm glad his stuff is going down the drain. I really am because. This is karma, baby. This is karma. What goes around, come back around. Ha! To say, ha ha, it serves you right, Mike Mendel. Because guess what? Instead of him using his money for something good, something wholesome, even donating it to a fucking church. He could have donated to a goddamn church, even if the church was sleazy as hell. Either way, it would have looked better than this. I like that. It did not sit right with a lot of people because this is someone who... Uh, said that they were a Christian, all right. So even if he's really not a Christian or whatever and really doesn't believe in all that stuff, 
it still makes people who truly do believe in this stuff look bad. I've actually talked about this before on my channel, but yes, I wish um, David Hall all the best. I hope his company goes well. And to be honest with you, baby, I'm all for Mac Mendel's company going uh, underneath and uh, getting, getting shoved into the bin because again, pillows ain't worth shit and he ain't worth shit. But anyway, before I end this video, I want to tell you about someone that is named Philip Wilson. Now, if you have not heard of him before, Philip Wilson is a black HIV slash AIDS activist, and he started an institute to help out the black community with AIDS in 1999, not too long after his partner died of the, uh, of the disease. And he used all his pain, all his tragedy to help people in the black community. This is something that I'm really glad to hear about that someone did so much to help out uh, out the black community with AIDS because at the time a lot of black people did not get help especially from where I'm from the AIDS crisis uh, where I come from in the south was absolutely terrible and now that the whole virus thing has started people are starting to be a little bit more reckless so we have a lot of more cases going on here now but I encourage everyone to read up about him and Use this as an opportunity to always take care of yourself, your sexual health, and each other. And that's all I have for today. As always, I'm Artifacts96, and I have nothing to lose but everything to gain. Bye.